Are business cards dead? Yours might be. This is why business cards are still relevant to me. This magic little box here, this holds not only my cards, but also my portfolio. The thing that's great about Moo is it allows you to put a different picture on every card. Whether I'm shooting a model or shooting an editorial portrait, a celebrity, all the little niches of what I do, I have a photograph on a business card that documents that style exactly. Print isn't dead if you use it right. I say, here, grab a business card. And I pass them the box. And they say, what's this? And they look through and they're like, oh man, are these all your photos? <gasps> Obviously, I'm not gonna put someone else's photo on my business card. They keep your business card because they chose one that they like. They chose a picture that they like. They chose something that they're like, wow, dude, this is dope. They put it on their mood board. And then you have your picture on their desk every day. My cards are like baseball cards. They're collectible. People keep them forever. So your business cards might be irrelevant because text on white, <laughs> you might as well show them your Instagram. <laughs> Been working on this project called Multiplicity. Personal work ends up being professional commercial work. How do people know about this work? You put it on your website, you put it on your business card. People grab that work, they go back to the office, they're like, look at this guy. These cards sell me better than I can sell myself. Long before social media, people used to give away business cards. I still do it and it still works.